I've been doing some work standing up for Reading Jail and calling for it to be turned into an arts and heritage centre and it's a great pleasure to have Historic England in Reading today to look at the site and to talk about the importance of the uh, heritage that's in Reading. Richard, I wondered if you just wanted to explain to people why the jail and the Abbey are so important. Well, the Abbey is one of the great medieval monasteries. Um, what we're standing in front of here is the chapter house. It's the burial place of Henry I and one of the things that shows you how important monasticism was in the Middle Ages and then the jail we have here is important for a number of reasons. Very early work by George Gilbert Scott, one of the greatest 19th century architects and he sort of cut his teeth here before going on to do things like St Pancras Station and the Foreign Office also, it's where Oscar Wilde was imprisoned, so this really interesting story about um, diversity and how um, people were treated in the past. So, uh, well, it. thank you for summarising that, and it's, it's an immense amount of history. We're very proud of it locally, and what we hope to do is to share that history with a much wider group of people around the country and indeed around the world. And I've been very moved by the level of support that we've had. Um, for the campaign to save the jail uh, and, and the level of interest as well particularly recently from the uh, chairman of the culture select committee in parliament I'm continuing to try and press that case and to remind people of the importance of these sites and it's an absolute pleasure to have you in it here in Reading today. Please do email me if you would like to um, receive more information about this.